What's up guys, Juggalo here. Hope everybody's having a great day as always. And today I'm going to do like a kind of uh, impromptu slash really, really brief uh, tutorial on how to do the BIOS flashing for my Kingpin cards. Now these is, or excuse me, this is pretty easy. And um, it's kind of the exact same way I flash my Titan cards my 590s especially if you've seen those uh, you pretty much already know what I'm going to use the most recent NV flash is 5 decimal 163 decimal 0 decimal 1 that is what you want to download also if you are going to flash your kingpin cards ensure that the LN2 switch is enabled on the very right hand side so you see on the left hand side where it says normal you switch it to the right and if you successfully did it while your computer shut off and then when you turn it on the red LED for LN2 should light up on all of your cards if not there's a problem go back shut down your computer and then re-ensure that you have the LN2 BIOS switch on to the right but that's what you have to do get NV flash again open it up here wind flash and pretty much all you have to do I'm gonna show you real quick but I'm not actually gonna do it so put both of the files or whatever files you want this one right here I'm actually gonna have to go into uh, the DOS settings to do that and basically you make a bootable USB and you do it this way to load up this one this one right here is by Skynet and the Skynet BIOS is let me see it's going to be labeled this one right here, Skynet Decimal K or TAC K P E TAC B D TAC R E V 6. You can get that through the overclock.net forums. I shall include a link below. This guy is really awesome, uh, helping us out in the uh, overclocking community. He has created a thread for. Kingpin owners, which is nice, so we can share our experiences and get the most performance out of our cards. Also, uh, I guess I might make another video about it, so I won't worry about that too much. But anyways, pretty much again, you're gonna download NV Flash, drag the files into the NV Windows Flash folder. I personally downloaded it and dragged it over here. And if you need to unzip it, unzip it download your BIOSes again this one right here open up with NV flash gonna hit yes and then it should load up something like this I'm not gonna hit Y because I already did it but you hit Y to confirm and it doesn't matter how many cards you have it will automatically update each card so you hit Y three times you're gonna BIOS flash your cards all three of them which is a pretty nice tool that is pretty much it guys if you need any help let me know uh, the DOS I'm kind of shady on because it's been a while so I'm gonna have to do research on that but as always guys comment subscribe rate this video click that like button and as always you have a great day now